No score, 10-10 left in the first quarter. Now the 49ers start with it from their own 24. That's Terrell Owens. That's Terrell Owens. That's a touchdown, San Francisco, no flags. Well, I guess it's growing as well. Two weeks off will do that for it. Here's a look at it. Jeff Garcia was hoping to come out in three wide set. They do to open up the ball game. They got Terrell Owens on the outside. He breaks the tackle, and once he gets out in front, there's no chance of running him down. Hey, here's what Jeff Garcia wanted to start the game with, was with three wide receivers. He was able to get that, and he felt that that would then spread the defense out and give him some room to operate. You know, all we heard yesterday was all we want is T.O. one-on-one. Will Allen and Will Peterson, they're good enough one-on-one. -on -one. Just leave us alone. We're going to get the job done. And the very first opportunity, Will Allen just bounces off of him. But I really think you've got to go back to why was Ron Dane in the ball game on the interception? Tiki Barber is your guy. He's done more than what they have. Garcia just changed the play at the line. Second down and eight, and that's Terrell Owens. Makes a quick spin move and hops out of bounds with a first down. And then it hit on the sideline, but no flag. Omar Stoudemire, who was one of three Giants players fined for trash talking and the like after that first game, was over there with a late hit. Well, Jeff Garcia with an audible because the safety is going to sneak up here. And now he knows he has one on one coverage on the outside with Terrell Owens. Checks off to the plate. That's all the 49ers want. One on one situations where he gets a chance to work against any quarterback in the league. Or Amani Toomer. Starting from their own 27, Garcia and the 49ers trying to answer. That's Owens. And he goes out of bounds with a first down at the 41. Well, one of the keys is if you can throw on first down, you don't get nearly the pass rush and you don't get the exotic coverages down the field that you would ordinarily get on the nickel situations. Here they basically fooled him. No pass rush to deal with. And Terrell Owens able to work in behind the linebackers. Anytime you can get T.O. on the linebackers instead of with man under and safety help over the top. First half, he hates only doing it when they get behind. Blitz coming from the Giants on second and six, and that's Owens. First down and one. Garcia just got it away. And that completes to Owens. Still on his feet. Terrell Owens takes a hit and goes in for the touchdown. Well, there's what we're talking about. Anytime that Jason Seahorn is going to be left one-on-one -on, -one on Terrell Owens, you've got to find him. And Jeff Garcia on this drive has done a heck of a lot better job than what he had done earlier. Well, right now, the 49ers are going to line up and go for two. Yeah, they're going to try to go for two to make it 38-22 and a 16-point difference. So then it's a two-score or two-possession game, and that's their thought here. And right now, they got Garrison Hurst spread wide. Now they went over there and got him covered. Quick throw, and it's Owens. Penalty flag on the play. Drop kick that helmet into a teammate's head. On second down. Owens, first down, just shy of the 44. That's just tremendous by Terrell Owens, just staying alive. He fakes to the outside. The linebacker, Short, is going to try and jump him, and he just jumps back to the inside. They're just playing some of the time. Third down and five. Pass is complete for a first down to Owens. Tell you what, they keep matching up Jason Seahorn inside when Terrell Owens lines up in the slot. And when Terrell Owens comes off the ball and just runs away from Jason Seahorn, he cannot keep up with him. This is not even close. If that ball's out in front of him, Terrell Owens may even score on the play. They're using that stack.